Hi guys, it's Mary Ellen. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thanks for stopping by. Today I'm creating a spread for my patron and my friend, Nicole. So if you'd like to see what I do for her this week, keep watching. All right, so Nicole uses a big happy planner and she said any week is fine, but she wanted a spread that felt like spring. She said I could do anything I want. It just something that made me feel springy. So I have some ideas. I am going to bring in these. So these are stickers from Archer and Olive. Um, they're really, really pretty and I haven't used them yet, obviously. There's like bumblebees and little hives and flowers. I love the colors. It felt spring-like to me. Disclaimer, which I have to say every so often, um, they are working on the floors today. They're refinishing the stairs. So right now it's kind of quiet. You might hear some sanding, but I don't really know what they're doing. You might hear some banging, but it is what it is, real life. Okay, so since Nicole said any week I decided to go with the first week in May and the reason I did that is because I have these numbers here but I don't have enough to do like you know 12 13 14 so I'm gonna do you know the first week so that I can just use these numbers because I think they're pretty I'm using an undated spread um, because I want to put these numbers up there and I don't want like to see the white out underneath so I don't know if these stickers are still available or not but I will link to a page that has like all the stickers and then you can see you know what else they have if these aren't available I hope they are because they're really pretty but I haven't checked so I don't know uh oh <gasps> oh no all right, we have another page, not to worry. So as we've talked about before, I, these patron videos have gone down to one per month where I do the spread for the patron. But I did do a video last week, and I hope you saw it, where I showed you all of the spreads I made for my patrons this month. There was 20 of them. Um, Nicole is number 21. But I really loved the spreads this month and I hope you guys love them too. Let me know if you want me to do that video every month. I can do that, show you what I did, you know. Okay, so, oh my gosh, these are so pretty. So let's get started on all of this. Now, I have jewel tone boxes. I also have the Happy Planner Mega Colorful Boxes. And I was looking at the colors because I wanna sort of try to match, especially this color. So I have some ideas. I thought maybe I would bring in some Tombos and sort of like decorate some of these boxes because you can change up your stickers as we've said. And you've seen me use Archer and Olive Acrylograph pens for changing up stickers, but you can also do things with other markers. And I just wanna show you how you can like color boxes with, which color was I gonna use? I was gonna make some stripes. Yes, I'm coloring right on here. I know, the horrors. Okay, so I thought I would make some stripes on these boxes and I'm basically just taking a Tombow dual brush pen. This is um, number 451. And I'm just gonna like make a stripe there and then make a stripe there and I'm overlapping it a little bit because I think that's fun. So I thought what I would do is create sort of these areas that are like flowy. I don't know. And I'm gonna bring in washi tape as well. I haven't really found that yet, but I thought I would just start at the top and sort of, and it might over, like go over some boxes though. But I thought it would be fun to just sort of create these little areas of, you know, just fun little I don't even know what to call them little like flowing areas <laughs> I don't know what we should do actually is bring in some hexagons in this spread because look it's like you know 
the hive, right? So I think that that might be a good idea um, to do that, right? So I'm sort of changing what I'm thinking here. We've got this little, this little thing that needs to be like with a B, right? I don't know. Let's try it. Ooh, how about this guy? He's sort of hovering. He's sort of hovering there. I don't know. That's weird. It doesn't really make sense. Let's go with it, though. So then maybe, like, we put this over here. Like, he's hovering near his hive, right? He's like just testing I don't know <laughs> I'm testing not him <laughs> oh boy let's put a box right here just to start it off okay now let's get some washi tape I'm gonna pause and look at my washi tape real quick okay so I found some washi tapes that I don't know I don't know um I kind of like this one because it has that same color right it's like tannish yellowish I like this but, uh-oh, oh no, oh no, it's ripping. Um, this is an older tape, so maybe that's why. Let's get some undo and try to undo this washi tape off the page. Not a great start to my spread. I just want this to be really pretty for Nicole. Nicole and I have become really good friends. She's a very sweet woman. Yes, I, uh, a recipe blog which is really cool you can follow her at daily dish recipes um, dot com or follow her I mean go to her blog and check it out she's got some yummy stuff on there so I think I want to keep going and let that dry for a minute I do like this but I I'm wondering if it's like too um, dark you know what I mean like too much of that green because there's really no green in here I'm leaning towards like this color here for boxes so I'm thinking the blue I don't think I have any boxes like this color I could do like this orange that'd be kind of cool but I think let's go with like this blue to start right and kind of move on from there now I feel like we can bring in some washi tape in this area because it feels like there's that space there, right? That's just not doing anything. What if we brought in a little piece of this? So that looks nice, right? A little area, a little cute area. I love these tiny little bugs. Oh my gosh. So if you buy anything at Archer and Olive, you can use my code Bumble, not Bumble, PWB10. It will get you 10% off anything except for subscription boxes and mystery boxes I believe I mean that's kind of cute I don't like that line there so let's wipe that out let's just take care of that baby we don't need it there see it's gone okay I'm just using a Sakura jelly roll pen I feel like something little needs to go next to that and we do have really tiny stickers here so let's grab another little tiny sticker like how about this little blue one? Right? Like, just fill that little space. So cute, right? Okay, so we have a cute little area. I almost want to bring in um, colored lines, right? I sort of want to do lines in, like, these soft colors rather than bringing in black. I know I also talked about hexagons. Let's see if there's any hexagons in here. I can bring in, like, my hexagon punch and do, like, a solid color. It's all up in the air at this time, you guys. There's none in there. How about the Colorful Shapes book might have some? Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna find what I want in here. So the question is, do I bring in hexagons? Do I get that punch and punch out hexagons in like some sort of pretty paper? Hmm. Let me pause and see if I have the paper, hang on. Okay, I don't really have the paper I was looking for, but I do have this really pretty washi tape. And this is from the washi tape shop. It is really wide, right? So I thought what I would do, I have my Fiskars, um, it's, I think it's Fiskars, yeah, 
a hexagon punch. So I thought I'd punch out some washi tape um, shapes and use these instead of like paper. So let's try that. Okay. <laughs> I'm making a mess. I'm making a mess. Okay, wait. This one was trash. Oh, that hurt my hand. Did you hear my knuckle crack? That hurt. Oh, it's hurting. I don't know what I did. Yikes. Oh, I did something to like my knuckle. It is a planner injury. Do you ever get planner injuries? I do sometimes. Like when I tried to like put all of my filler paper in on discs and it took like hours and then I had like, I was really sore on my finger from like pushing it down. <laughs> Too bad I don't have workers comp, right? It's just me, <laughs> me, myself and I. <laughs> Nobody's gonna pay for my medical bills when I hurt myself at work, oh well. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, so last night, Mike actually really did hurt himself last night. He was getting something off the stove and it's our new gas stove and like the, it has those like grates and it caught like I don't know if it's the pot holder or like something caught on the grate and lifted up the grate while he was taking off a big pot of boiling pasta that so that caught it hit the pot it caused the pot to spill and it went on his wrist so he was hurting I hope it doesn't blister too bad it was starting to blister today um, but yeah that was like scary that was our night <laughs> um, like I want to put this down but I want to put something on top like a box so let's get another one of these boxes I feel like a longer box is needed here so like maybe this one. I don't like that it has graph paper, but I can live with it. I want this to show, but I don't want it to be the focal point. I want it to be sort of in the background. Okay, so ooh, that's really pretty, isn't it? And it really does match the colors. I'll link all this stuff for you. Don't worry. I really try to do that um, so that you know like where I get everything. Okay, this is going to go a little bit across two days, Nicole. So... This is for Monday though, unless you need it for Tuesday and then make it for Tuesday. All right, so now let's do a little bit of stripe action down here, but we're going to use the stripes at the bottom, I think. We could even do stripes vertically. Hmm. Let's do that. Do one like that and then like, I sort of want to bring in this pink, but it's gonna feel sort of dark. Maybe I do like a skinnier line than the blue, right? Okay, so there's that. I don't know how I feel about that yet, but we're just gonna keep going. So let's put something right around this area. Pop that down right there. Okay, there's our little scene. Now we're gonna put some lines in down here. Let me get a checklist. I'm really not digging this, but I'm gonna leave it alone for now and see how I'm feeling. So, I'm gonna make a checklist. I'm gonna do it with these like delicate colors. So I'm guessing like maybe this pink color, right? When you're doing the lines with like colored pens, you have to do it very quickly. If you do it too much in one place, it's going to like double up and be darker like there. Do you see that? So be careful of that. That's real light. It's probably hard to see. Okay, let's use this to-do list. I know there's to-do lists here and here, but these don't have to be to-do lists. Let's put this in though. I feel like it needs to be here. It's gonna balance out like these colors up top. I know it's dark, but I think it's gonna work, especially if we pull some of that in to the other side. Let's just see how it looks. That's real dark though, isn't it? I feel like we're gonna need to bring in another one up here to match it or bring in like, darker colored boxes of some sort. I don't know. I'm feeling insecure now. <laughs> Nicole, I'm feeling insecure. It was going really well. 
up here. It was so cute. Now I'm like, eh. But let's keep going. Okay, and then a little design down here, right? Because we, we've got to continue that design throughout the page. We've got a lot going on at the top. We need a little busyness at the bottom. So let's put maybe one of these guys here. I do want to bring in more of this. So I sort of wanted, I sort of wanted to do it right here. Let's see if we take this off. Oh, it came off. Yay. I always sort of like to tie in the washi tape, like at the, um, like in the other parts of the page. So that, that makes sense to me. So let's do that. This is one of my favorite washies. Love, love, love it. It came in a pack of like different grids and I'll find that for you. Where's my exacto? Oh, different like grid washies that are like interesting and not like your average grid, you know, and I like it. And this is a really good color. It kind of goes with a lot of stuff. So this is one of my favorites. I'm running out though. I'm getting really close to the end. <laughs> I might have to get more. What if I took this off and used like the stripes on the bottom instead? I feel like the, the vertical stripes are throwing me. If you like it, I'm sorry. I'm going to try something else. I think we need undo again. I'm getting hungry. It's 1.15. All I had for breakfast was like chips because, <laughs> because we haven't gone to the store and like we haven't been cooking because of the floors. It's just been a mess. Okay, let's get another one of these. I just feel like it wasn't making me happy. Do you ever feel that way? It just wasn't doing it for me. Maybe it was the orange though. Maybe it's because it was orange, but I don't think so. Let's try to do those stripes on the bottom and see. Let's get that other one. Um, that is better in my opinion. Okay, I like that better, cool. We'll put this aside for a second with all the other stickers that are on the side here that you're not seeing. Okay, so since that's there, we're gonna to wanna to bring in more of these. So we'll put another one here and we'll pair it with like a smaller box. Boy, they're loud up there, you hear them? They're making jokes. Hardy har. Okay. <laughs> How about we bring it up slightly? Maybe we even bring in a second one there you know we could do an orange there all right so there's a couple boxes for thursday i almost want to do a stripe on this one right across the middle okay and then we'll put this little guy down here just for fun he's crooked little hive i'm kind of not liking the lightness of these lines but we're gonna, just gonna see we're gonna see uh so let's move on up moving on up and get a blue box that's like a, a tall one of those full a full box so to speak not a tall box a full box i'm gonna pop it on this side so i can layer other boxes on top of it i'm not i'm, I'm not doing a lot of chatting you up in this video because i'm trying so hard to think <laughs> Sometimes you don't get chatty videos because like I'm really thinking. Do you know what I mean? Like some some spreads take a lot of thought process and this is one of them. Oh wait, what about this? I feel like I should bring this in. Now I know it's gonna it's like the same, but we can switch it up to be different. Let's do that. I feel like I just need more dark color up here. So let's layer that on top of here for like Friday. Okay, bear with me. Um, oh, I should have put this. Wait a minute. Lift and stickers, right and left. That's the planning with Bumble Way. I can't help myself, especially when I'm making it for other people. You know what I mean? Like, geez. This is kind of cool because you can't really see that it's turned the other way. You can't really see that it's like the hexagon but 
you can see the pattern, which is neat, right? All right, let's do this. Okay. So let's switch this up. Like I said, let's make it different because it's, you know, if you have two of the same stickers, you can always put stickers on top of stickers to change them up. We can put something else to cover that area there. Like this little hive that might be a little big. We can put this guy on there. Let's see what that would look like. I sort of want blue on there though, but he fits pretty good, doesn't he? Let's do it. Nicole, I am giving you like my favorite stickers. I've been hoarding these because I really like them. I really like these. I think they're so cute. We can even switch up these little things, but I'm not sure we need to. Ooh, we probably should though. Because look, there's these tiny, all right, let's do it. There's these tiny, tiny, tiny little like bees and flowers. And I kind of want to do that. So I might fast forward this part because this might take a little bit, but do you ever just want to take teeny, tiny, teeny, tiny, little itty bitty stickers and put them on other stickers? I do. These are cute. These are little babies. They're little babies. Oh, Wallace looked at me like, are you talking to me? He's laying on the floor over there. Little itty bitty babies. Look, there's a little crown. Oh my goodness, that's really cute. I don't know that I'm gonna fast forward this part. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Are you seeing this? If you're seeing it, you lucked out. You lucked out, you're seeing it, and, and I almost didn't show it to you. So there you go. All right, boom, cute. Now that one looks so bare. Mm. This one's so pretty. Okay, so let's decorate these guys a little. When you're doing this, like try not to worry too much about like how it looks. Like I'm not worrying about getting the lines perfectly straight or anything. It kind of looks better when they're not, you know what I mean? And then down here, uh, I kind of, I'm gonna put one stripe here that's like yellow and then I'll put like I'll decorate this box in some way like something fun like maybe put something on top of that this yeah okay so that's that box um, we need to bring in that washi right I'm gonna pull that in somewhere too um, maybe just Hmm, maybe up here? This is taking much thought, Nicole, much thought. All right, lines need to go here, no. Here, you know what, let's just bring blue in here. I know I didn't wanna do that, but I kinda want to, cause these are feeling so light. These are gonna be light too though. Ooh, they're even lighter. What I could do is go over top of it with like um, black, I might do that. A little more washy probably because we have some here 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 i like to balance it so let's put a little bit right here on sunday i'm kind of calm today do you notice that not a real wacky day <laughs> not a wacky spread like like last week that i had a real wacky one you know but sometimes that's what you get sometimes you get wacky sometimes you get calm you never know with me i'm just concentrating okay Let's put this here. That's nice. And now, see we have the scene here, these things kind of floating in the air. I wanna do that again. I wanna do that. I think I wanna do it right here because I just feel like it. That's the only reason. And because Nicole will appreciate it. So let's do that. And this time we're gonna do more little trails, I think, right? Let's do another little trail and another bee, another couple of bees. Oh, they're so cute. But we're not gonna do it this way because that's that way. We're gonna flip it. Flip it and reverse it. You sure? All right, never mind. <laughs> if you're my age, you'll get that. If not, you might be like, what? <laughs> what? What is she talking about? 
Are you sure? I can't do that part though. Are you sure I didn't ban yet? That's how I do it. <laughs> That's my version. If you can do that, hey, more power to you. Okay. Let's put the, this here at the bottom of that little guy, little swirly, but we're gonna do this thing. We're gonna do that thing, you know. I just don't know how. I could do a real swirly, but not gonna do that. Ooh, that one's really pretty. Look at that. There's so many little stickers on here that I, I'm missing them. All right. I could put gold boxes in here, but I kind of don't want to. Ooh, I know what I'm gonna do with this crown. Do you know what I'm gonna do with this crown? <laughs> You know what I'm doing with the crown. Oh my goodness. All right. Can't forget that at the end, okay? <laughs> if I forget, remind me. Okay. Little things. Let's put a little, not that one. We just put that there. Maybe like another B. Just a couple little flowers floating around. Whimsical and fun. I don't know floating in the air <laughs> at least I think we could put the gold crown on Bumble um, and then this guy he's up there too but we'll put him here again like because he belongs in that little swirly bit there okay we got two swirly bits I might need another hive there just to like because like these guys are floating around and they don't have a place to live and that's really sad so we're gonna give them a place to live and a place to make their honey. Okay, I've got this going on, yes. Another box, right? Boxes. We're getting there. It's a, t it's a tough one, it's a long one. An orange box, I think. There's a little thingy on the top. I don't know what's going on there. I don't like it. I don't like it. Let's cut that off. So I think these patron spreads, like, the one I do every month is going to be long. <laughs> and and that's kind of the point. They were all getting long, which is why I had to stop them. But the the one that I do is, is definitely going to be a long one. So if you're somebody who likes the long videos, you're going to really like that every month. If you're someone who doesn't, you might want to skip the patron one. There's something for everyone, I guess. If you don't like that, then you'll like maybe another kind of video I make, I guess. Let's do stripes. Uh, maybe just blue. I feel like that's all by itself though. Maybe a little pink, a little pink. Okay. Ooh, this is really pretty. This one needs to go somewhere and I feel like he's gonna go in the sidebar. Like he needs a place. Should he just be flying? Should he be up top? I'm gonna write in May. Should he be here next to this week's lists? Yeah flying around the list you know what I'm gonna do I am gonna take a black Muji and I'm gonna go over um, the lines again because I just feel like they're hard to see but I like the idea of the color being under them so I think it will look kind of cool I just have to make sure that like it's kind of exact and not you know or close to exact you know what I mean I don't want it to be completely different off of it I want it to like Complement it. Okay. So that does change the look of it. I know it was real delicate, but like you can barely see these lines and I just felt like it wasn't enough. So whether that's a good thing or a bad thing, I don't really know, but it's a thing anyway. So it's a thing. Wallace, don't come up here. I've got bees and flowers and hives and pens and washi. I don't need a Wallace up here right now. Okay, buddy? I know you want to see me. I know you love me. You're going to have to wait until we're done. Okay. So it's kind of cool because I don't know if you can, if the camera picks that up, but you can sort of see the color behind those lines. And I sort of like it. It's I've never done that, I don't think, like on purpose anyway. So I think I kind of like that look for something new. It's very subtle. You can barely tell, but I kind of like it. Okay. All right. 
We're getting very close to the end. Does that make you sad or happy? I don't know. Okay, this one. Look at that. That's messed up. Don't want to use that. Let's use this and we'll do another um, yellow one, I guess. Like a yellow line thingy. Pop it down. Bees usually like scream summer to me, but let me tell you, there are bees in the spring. We have bees in the house right now because um, with the, fl the floor guys keep like leaving the doors open while they're cutting wood and stuff. And we have bees in the house. And Almond has been finding them all and playing with them and makes me nervous that she's gonna get stung. I let one out today while she was playing with it. I'm like, no. She likes to play with flies and bugs and stuff. She kills them. <laughs> okay. We are almost done. We're almost done. Thank you for sticking it out with me today and, and hanging out. I know it's a long one, but like we're almost done. And I appreciate you hanging, hanging with me, you know, hanging out. Let's put a sun by this little guy. He deserves it. Ooh, maybe it should go right here though. Come on. No, it would cover it. Never mind. The sun's shining down on that little bee. It makes me like bees a little bit more. So let's use this little flower pot and put it here, I guess. Let's cut the bottom so it looks realistic, like, like it's actually sitting on the box. Yeah. Or we could put it there. That would be kind of fun, but let's put it here. Uh, okay, Bumble's going to sit here, I think. I know. She's in the middle of the spread, but I usually put her down like in the corner somewhere, but I don't know. I feel like she belongs like there. I'm afraid, though, because that bee, he's looking nasty. I don't want her to be stung, but... So these are stickers from Proud Sticker Designs. Um, Nicole, she's a patron of mine. She's really sweet, and she sends me boxes sometimes, but she made these custom Bumble stickers for me, and I didn't know that she was doing that for other people, but she is, so I will link her website um, in the description. So if you want, like, custom pet stickers, I think she's still doing them really fun to get stickers of your pet let's see which hat is going to fit which crown is going to fit princess bumble mm, i'm thinking this one and we're going to mold it to her head like this we're going to cut it like this <laughs> so that it fits her head although this is like really black there i kind of i should put her down here I definitely should. Maybe all the way at the bottom. Let's cut this white part off. I think just in this corner here. Princess Bumble. Matching the spread. Look at her in all her glory. She's a beauty, folks. She is a beauty. I'm going to make something... Um, down there like she's sitting next to flowers, you know, because she deserves it. No bees down in this area. None. Mm -mm. No bees for Bumble. Flowers. Ooh, I'm going to write a bee on her crown. Bee. <laughs> it's the little things that make me happy. What can I say? All right. Um... Another little flower for Bumble? Maybe. Maybe another little, like, oh, wait. There's some over here. Just a little something or other. She's in a little garden. Having, you know, living her best life down there in the corner of the spread. Okay. Just about done, you guys. Okay. It's a little bit challenging not using the happy planner stickers because usually when I use happy planner stickers, I have like headers and stuff. Do you know what I mean? There's really no headers on this and I'm trying to avoid using the headers. Like I'll fill little gaps, you know, with headers and stuff, but I don't really need to do that with this because like these cute illustrations are just so fun. I feel like something needs to go there. Maybe like a tiny bee. Another one flying around. 
See, then this looks, <laughs> I'm taking it off. That's what happens if I put one little sticker, then like another part of it looks bare. I'm gonna leave it like that, okay. So next I'm just gonna work on the sidebar real fast. I'm gonna write May up here in, what color? I'm thinking like blue, right? That makes sense. Cause these are like the other colors, so. May, a big May there for you. We have a visitor. <laughs> Lunchtime. <gasps> oh, Mike makes me, <laughs> makes me meals and he buys me meals all the time. He's such a good fiance, food giver. Um, I would like you to surprise me. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> He's gonna surprise me with a Wawa lunch. What do you think he's gonna get me? You're probably not gonna know because by the end of this, because I'm almost done, he won't be back yet. So you might not know what he gets me. If you want um, to know, maybe you can leave a comment asking what I had for lunch and I'll tell you then, because I'm gonna forget. I'll forget to leave a comment. Since like the floors are being done, we really can't use the kitchen. It's not going well in the kitchen right now. It's so dirty and everything. So, um, so he's been going out and getting me lunch. It's very sweet. All right. Um, okay. So we're almost done here. I just want to put something else there. I need like a box to write to Nicole, maybe some bullet points over here. This is getting very long. What else is new, Mary Ellen? Let's do a couple little floral bullet points down below on this, on there. Nicole, those will be your priorities for the week, right? In fact, I'll write priorities here. An exclamation point. Okay, there's your priorities for the week, Nicole. And now let's put a box down for a note. Should we pull in a little more of this? Because I have another one. Let's pull another one over there. Um, let's cut this one down. And we'll layer a box on top of it. It's just going to give a little bit of interest, right? My lunch man didn't leave yet. There's <laughs> an issue. What's the issue? Bumble. Oh, I'm almost done the video. Like, literally, like, almost done, like, now. Okay, let's just pop this down there for a little color right at that side part. I know they're dying to know what you choose for me for lunch, but... They're not gonna know. Mike is playing darts. Do you hear that? <laughs> I like these because they have like the gold and there's gold in this, so that makes sense to me. We'll do a pink. Although that's pink there. Let's see what orange would look like. No, there's orange right there. Blue, blue, pink, which one looks better. Eh. Let's do blue with the pink stripe or, or pink with the blue stripe. <laughs> Why is this so difficult? All right, this is like a different blue anyway than that one. So let's do the pink. And I guess I wanna put it over here, but then we've got that little area there. We can, we can put something else there. Like, I mean, we can leave it like that. That's a tiny bit crooked, Nicole. I might have to um, fix that when we when I go get off the video. Oh, I can just put washi there. Sometimes when you have a little piece in the sidebar that you need to fill up or that looks kind of empty, put your washi down, folks. It really does help. I know I just wasted a lot of it. Helps kind of break it up, right? Into different sections and also like pulls in some color you might need, whatever. Okay. Now like this part, I don't know. Some things like, eh. I probably should bring that washi all the way to that one. 
Let's see what that would look like. Put this here. You're not even gonna be able to tell, I don't think. Look at that, you can barely tell. Let's write Nicole right now. Okay, now what we can do underneath Nicole is put a little blue stripe, just a tiny blue stripe. And then I'll write Nicole a note down there. Okay, this is my really cute springtime spread for Nicole. I'm in love with it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments and I'll see you in my next video. Bumble says bye-bye. See ya.